Hello to all, what's up? Uh, guess what? Uh, so I was just out, uh, exploring and stuff, and I was doing a bunch of off-camera resource collecting. See, I got all these resources, and I see them off, I got some more stuff, and then this other storage compartment, I got some more stuff. I was just getting some resources so I could prepare for the, today's episode, you know? I'm, I'm recording this two days before I upload it, actually, but I wanted, to, I wanted to prepare for once, you know? So I, I just got a whole bunch of resources. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go home now. I was going towards my home beacon. And I saw this, this hole inside of the mountain. I'm like, ooh, shortcut. So I went in the hole, hoping it popped me out of the opposite side of the mountain. But that didn't happen, and now I'm here. I'm in this scary cave. Uh, there's a purple alien tablet there. And, uh, well. Not the cool music. That's new. I'm gonna pick this up. Well, I got a tablet now. Um, also, I have no battery, no extra batteries. I forgot to take that out when I was exploring, which kind of stinks. Now I'm in this cave. I lost where I first found the shortcut hole, but I found something different and very unexpected. Do you hear that roar? Yeah, that's the roar of a Reaper Leviathan. I mean, of, yeah, a Reaper Leviathan. The kind of thing that'll drag this Seamoth down to the crushing depths and then crush me in the depths. But, uh, the thing is, there's something here. I, I forgot where I found it. But this purple tablet should give you a hint if you know anything about this game. Um, yeah, I had no idea really where I really was. I kind of got carried away in my resource collecting. Yeah, look at this. Oh, it's, it's it's air. It's a cave. This is a on surface cave. I found in an underwater cave. And guess where it freaking leads? Stop growling. This is a cave I've been to before. Just, I, I've always come into this cave from a different angle. This is, this is new. This is new. I was just resource collecting, man. And I found this cave, and I'm like, whoa, it's a sky! And I'm like, wait a minute, I'm on an island! Yeah, it's crabby, guys. Oh, land. Like, oh, I recognize this cave. If I peek right on over here, aren't I gonna say, yep, there's a giant freaking alien tower! Um, in other words, I am in a place I've never been before in this world. And I'm, I'm kind of concerned about it. See, there's a giant alien structure here, and I want to explore it, but guess what? I can't, because I have no inventory space. There's going to be goodies to collect inside of there. And I, I don't have nearly enough space to carry it with me. But look at that thing! You know? I need to get to that! I, if I remember correctly, there's another purple tablet. Right on... Yep, there's one right here. Yeah! You need this tablet... Put in that thingy there and open up the gate. I'm not gonna do that just yet though. I'm gonna wait for another time. Another day. Ooh. Ow! I wanna, put a, I wanna put a beacon here. <laughs> I, I'm thirsty too. This is a bad situation actually. Um, and I can't get my steam off out here and just, just swim away. Not to mention I've been hearing Leviathan screams for the past few minutes. It's very open water, which means a very, very Leviathan prone water. Um,. Go away, little biter. I, I don't care about you. So, uh, essentially, I need to get home, and I need to find a way out of this, this island with my steam off. Because I'm not going to leave him in here. I, need, I just need to find an exit again. The thing is, I want I want to leave Beacon here. I, I don't know if I can find it again. See, my, my, my freaking base... Well, it's not, it's not that far away. It's like almost 900 meters away. Um, actually, I might, be, I'm, I'm, I'm be, I might be able to do something, actually. Alright, hold on. If I go back in this cave, all right, and I come back to my sea moth where uh, some more resources are, are stored. Right, can I put can I put down this 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 guy somewhere? Yeah, I can put it right here. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. Can I make a hatch. Scanning. Okay, I'll, I'll also make a hatch. Safe fluid. Yeah, I need fluid intake. I know that. Uh, just give me some time. Give me some time. Some copper. Uh, I, I need, uh, fabricator. Table core, I need a table core! And my plan is no longer in action, because I need a table core sample. I wanted to make a beacon with the, the fabricator, but I don't have any table core with me, do I? No, I, I no, I don't. I'll, I did that my, my last resource run, just before I came out here, okay. Now it's a risk against me dehydrating to death, and fighting a way out of this cave. Well, I'm still listening to the Reapers, so <laughs> I'm just gonna swim around now. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, uh, I wasn't—I wasn't wanting to come in this in this place, man. I just wanted to go home. I was looking for a shortcut. I didn't find it. 
what I said before. Um, this might be actually the way out. I'm not sure where I need to go. There's a lot of ways to go in this cave. Um, I, I need to go over here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Hey, I found it. Okay, good. I'm not lost anymore. Yeah, this is a big hole I found. See, I saw my beacon through there. I'm like, oh, look, a shortcut. So I went in there, and it didn't work. Apparently, I'm next to an island. I didn't even notice. Yeah. So if I start going to the surface, I'm scared of the open water. Yeah, I didn't even notice there's a freaking island there. <laughs> um. Yeah, I, I should be able to find this from my base, right? Yeah, it's just it's just the opposite direction from the Aurora. That works. Okay, well, um, in that case, I'm going to see you guys when I'm at base, and I am more prepared for life. So, see you then. Oh, uh, I have four water left. Oh, what's a firefish? No, go, come back, come on. Hey. I need to drink you. Never do I fall. Get, 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 get out. Yeah. Where do you go? There you are. Uh. Yes. <laughs> I can taste you already. I need to drink your bones. I don't think that's how it works, but I don't care. I'm going to drink all of you. Oh, my word. Uh, so this is water. Mm. I have two left. Uh, ha, ha, ha. Vital signs stabilized. Oh. <laughs> the peeper's stuck on the... We gotta come back. The, the peeper's stuck on the floater. <laughs> I'm gonna scan the floater. Look at it. <laughs> You poor little peeper, you're stuck. Oh my. I feel a bit better now. Okay, everything's back to normal, and I'm safe at home. Now, the purpose of this episode, I believe, should be... Passing 100 meters. Yeah. I need I need to I need to upgrade my, my uh, oxygen tank. Anyway, purpose should be to uh, base upgrades and stuff. I added this little room here for a reason. Also, these bone checks have been really annoying recently. I've been doing stuff around the around the around the, around the house, and they're everywhere, man. Every time I park my sea moth, I always gonna get a nab at it first. Yeah, I see you. I'm going back inside. It's just part of it, I guess. Part of life. Anyway, um, I'm prepared. I've got some stuff ready to craft, and I'm excited about it. Um. Uh, so let me see. I first of all, I want to make this modification station. So computer chip, diamond, titanium. I think I have all that. So ah, in this duffel bag I got from the Aurora, got everything I need for that. And there we go. Modification station. So I think I'm gonna put you right there. That seems about right. Yeah. And with this. I will be able to upgrade my oxygen tank, actually. Air tank, upgrade. Lightweight head capacity, ultra high capacity. So, I need to make this. Or do I? What do I have on me? Standard hotel. Okay. So, that's me. The plastic ceiling. I don't have that. I'll upgrade that later, then, when I'm more prepared for it. I just got. I got yeeted by somebody in my stream chat. Okay, anyway. Um, also. It appears here you don't need a repulsion cannon fragments, you just need the box to craft it. Yeah, that's what, that's what I thought. I was told otherwise, but I, I am now correct. Alright, uh, so, I got this. I can make cool stuff with this at some point, but first I want to make everything else I wanted to make. Um, yeah, I think... Oh yeah, I can, I can upgrade my Seamoth depth module as well. That takes a lot of stuff, though. Okay, anyway, anyway. I also have this stuff to make. A scat no wrong one. <laughs> um, I have stuff to make. A bioreactor, yes. That's what this extra room over here is for. I need this bioreactor for energy and stuff. Uh let me how do I flip you? Oh, scroll. Yes. There we go. And done. Critical step towards self sufficiency. Very true. Keeping a photo journal of your achievements to motivate you in times of despair. Eh, Alright, okay. And. 
Boom, screenshot, there we go. That's the motivation, just in case. Uh, now I need something to put inside of it for uh, energy, you know. Let's see. Hmm. What do I have that can be destroyed? How about an egg? Uh, do I have any extra eggs? I don't really lose the ones I already have. I have that egg. I think I got a different egg recently. No, I have one of you. I, uh, I can get this egg later. Let's go ahead and check this guy in. And energy! There we go, active. So now it's building up charge and will give my base better power. I, I'm tired of living off of solar charge, solar panels. The bigger my base gets, the less adequate that's going to be. Now, my next uh, plan, I believe. We get this. Um, actually, there's stuff in here. Here, I mean, yeah. There's this, there's that. There's this, I think. What else did I want to make here? Uh, I know for a fact that I wanted to make a battery charger. I need titanium. There it is. Now, I have a whole lot of freaking batteries thanks to the trip to the Aurora last episode. The big bad ship there. Let me collect all of them out of my lockers right now so I can start charging them. That's one with 1%. A bunch of batteries here. Uh, there's none there. But I believe there. Nope, none there either. But there's got now. There's more around here. Right. Did I miss a locker or something? Ah, yeah, there's the rest of my batteries. <laughs> there we go. Uh, how how much is it? Okay, that needs chart. No, that's good. That's not. That's not. That's good. Not good. Not not good. Nah. I mean, it is good. So I have six batteries that need to be charged right now. Let me go ahead and make this thing battery charger. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll put you. No, no, no. I want to put something. Uh, I want to put a poster right there. I think. No. No, I don't put posters elsewhere. There we go. Battery charger. Okay, it can charge four at a time. That'll also take power from my base, but I just need a solar, I mean, bioreactor. That'll be fine. So charge you. Put you in there. Put you in there. You in there, and you. I'll charge the other two later. Look at this. They're all in there charging up. Look at it. So it's per per percentages and everything. Sweet. All right. That's working. That's working. Now, for my next build. I want to make a scanner room, so I'll take five titanium. One, two, three, four, five. So I haven't actually planned exactly where I'm going to put this. I uh, hope this, the freaking bone sharks will leave me alone. I should make a repulsion cannon at this point. Um, I think. Rar. I think. Could I? Could I just like? I, I can't. Oh, I can do that, but I don't want to do it. There's my beacons there anyway. Um, tell you what. <laughs> Dang, I need a battery for this thing. Hi. Get out of my base, you weirdo. Ah. Uh, I think I put it on that side of my... Mm, I don't want to do that. If I go in here... I'll, I'll branch it out there. Yeah, that'll work. Straight down that way. I haven't planned everything 100%. But, okay. I don't need to. And right here. And there you go. Scanner room, if you don't know, is like, uh, it's, I, I don't really know what to call it, but essentially it's, it's a surveillance and stuff. It can scan for resources and stuff. See this guy on the side here? I have, I have remote control cameras I can, I can control from inside of this thing. I'm excited to use those. Um, wait, oh no, there's damage in my hole. I need to take this down, actually. I'm losing the whole strength. I'm gonna start popping holes in my base, aren't I? And there's a sand- there's a- is that Boontrick attacking my base, actually? That could be what's happening here. Yeah, I need to- Oh, shoot. Go away! Uh, how- I'm, why is he not biting me? And I'm, I'm starting to drown. Mm -mm. Ah. Why'd it get dark? Oh, there's water inside the base! Uh, okay, uh... There's a hole here. Repair. Is that fine? Nope, there's more. Where's, where's the other holes? Oh, there's water coming out of the wall! That's not what I need! And it's... Okay! I didn't even repair that hole. I was getting excited. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Problem solved. I need to make um, some protection for my base. So that means I need uh, re reinforcements. So lithium and titanium. There's a whole bunch of both. There we go. So I'm just going to put this... Right, now I can't put those in. Okay, that's cool. 
Put that there. Yeah, that seems good. And I'll put another one there. Seems fine. How much titanium do you have left? Titanium. Oh, I don't, I don't think I have enough of the scanner room now. Freaking dang it. I hear you screaming! Go away! I've been recording for uh, a good bit before, we, like, like in between spots, so I don't really know exactly when to stop this this episode. I guess I can edit out the I want. I need to throw this out in the air, actually. I brought this mobile vehicle bag back from the old uh, storage tube from the beginning of the series. Be free! Whee! Okay. I need more titanium. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, that should be enough. Now I can equip this guy back. And put down, I think, one more um, reinforcement. That'll that'll be fine. And I feel a bit better about my base now. Ah, there's a shark there! Ah, he bit! Oh, my word, that's painful! I need to make it. I don't see anything. I need battery on my seam off, too. Okay. I'm gonna go in and out of my base. I'll over and over and over. Okay, let me find... Oh, I put him in this locker, didn't I? Yes. Re... Charge you. Yes, there we go. These guys are like almost halfway percent. Now! Am I safe here? I think I am. I'm gonna put this scanner room back. Should be fine. Okay. And there we go. Yeah, I have plenty of full strength now. I'm gonna go in there and take a look at this guy. I think it's pretty much everything I was putting in a craft. Alright, ooh, look at that! I have a 3D holographic display of my home up this wall right here. That is where the Aurora is. Actually, that'd be really cool to have on the on the map, the Aurora. It's not quite there, though. So that's my base, those little green dots there. Actually, those might be my uh, beacons, like my, my Seamoth beacon and my regular beacon. So I can scan for stuff here. Takes battery. I can scan for wreck, titanium, shell. That's, what, that's all the stuff in range. Let me scan for rubies, actually. That'd be cool. Scanning. There's one right there. See that little red guy? I'm pretty sure if I go out on my own, I'll be able to see those on my, my HUD. I can use this fabricator to make some upgrades for this place. I can make extra camera drones. I can make uh, upgrades. So when my scanner room finds out information, I guess it'll tell me when I'm away. Um, more range and speed upgrades. So it'll scan stuff faster. I don't really need that stuff right now, though. So I'm going to leave it be. Let me, take, let me take a look at my camera, though. Ooh, look at that. Oh, let me go back. Go back. So go back. Back in the little hole. There we go. Can I switch between... Oh, how many cameras do I have? Okay, just the two, I think. Yeah, that's cool. See, look, when I'm in my camera now, I can go out, pop out in this little camera guy. And look, there's there's where the rubies found. That was right, right, right next to me, right nearby. There's the ruby. I can't collect it with the camera drone, but I can look around with it. I can I can swim around here. It's got different audio. Ooh, look, it's just a little, it's a little pocket of nothing. Ain't that cool? So this could be useful if I don't want to get bitten by stuff. Like, if, if I'm being raided by bone sharks, which I am a lot of the time, I can tell one of these guys out there. I don't know if the bone sharks will attack you, though. And I don't know if you can repair these guys if they're blown up, but, you know. Safe exploration here. That's cool. I don't know how much range they have. Um, that looks pretty good, though. Sweet. So, how do I get out of this? Just escape? Yeah, okay. Oh, and it gives me a picture. Oh, yeah, that's weird. And now uh, you can... Stop scanning for Ruby now. Stop taking my power. All right, I got another distraction message. I don't know how long I've been, I've been uh, recording now. What else can I do? Oh, I can, I can do stuff with my seam off. Right? Do I have more of it? Does that see? Does does that say see Doyfin? See Doyfin? Or is that just like? Ah! Is that just like paint? Paint mi misconception. Yeah, it's see Dolphin. Yeah, you're my sea dolphin. Okay. Um, oh, I can make a bronze. Ah, I have plans, man. Um, okay, I want to make that whole reinforcement so I can not take damage every time I bump into a rock, which happens rather often with me in sea moths. <laughs> you might say four diamonds. It's not quite expensive. Well, I have plenty of ding ding diamonds. Trust me. It's I find shale outcrops as in diamonds. A lot more than I find freaking 
the uh, limestone outcrops, which is a lot less valuable. So now if I go over here, and yeah, whole reinforcement. Sweet, there goes four diamonds, but that's okay, because it's worth it. Put that in the only empty slot I don't have. And bam. I said bam. There we go. So now if I get my Seamoth. Okay, so if I bump into stuff like this. Okay, I take... I take less damage, yeah! <laughs> I'm also pretty sure if, like, little fish run into my Seamoth, it won't take damage, because that can happen sometimes. It's kind of annoying. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just stronger now. So it won't, it won't blow up as easily. It won't be popped as easily. As some have been. Now. Um, I think that's all I wanted to do. Currently. I got a lot of stuff done. And these better still charging. How long have we been... Hmm. 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 I think it's... I think that's good, actually. I got what I wanted to get done. Done. Um, later on... When I have more resources, I, I might have enough, actually, for some of this other stuff. I'll, I'll upgrade my oxygen tank, because I really need to do that! Unpowered! Inactive! Did you consume that entire egg already? Okay. Guess what else I have, punk? Oh, still my sea moth. Still stuff I need to take out of here. I have... Creep vine! Run, creep vine! But that should still work! Let me go ahead and get all this junk out of here. Give me, give me, give me. Oh, there's another egg as well. Uh huh. Okay. Do I already have this egg somewhere? I think I do. Right, right. No, don't name that. Right, where, do I, I have it somewhere? Yes. No. Different kind of egg. There's a lot of eggs in this game. Well, whatever. I'm gonna put in creep vine, and that should help out. I don't know how much power it's gonna be gaining here. Oh, you can see doing stuff inside there. Look at that. That's cool. Poor little creep vine. Okay. Um, I don't need- I guess I don't need to kill my egg just yet. Uh, that's what I should- okay, now, when I collect a bunch of random eggs, like, I, I think I have extra eggs, little small eggs around here somewhere, right? Yeah, I have these eggs. I can throw those in if I need to. But I won't do that just yet. That's like emergency kind of stuff. Yeah, okay. Okay, I think that is fine then. I think I'm good. Uh, alright, yeah, crafting done, progress made, uh, I really want to do this radio message, but I'll do it later, I need to get back on that, but I have so much stuff to do, you know, I can get back to that island, explore the alien stuff, I can make a prom suit now, which would be awesome, I got a boo from somebody else, there's two people that's, that's messaged me so far while recording this, okay, let me go up to the surface, oh wow, that is, that is high up, I forgot how, how low I was, okay, that's okay, get all the way up here, and I'll see how much resources I need to make a prawn suit now. Oh man, that's... It's a far distance. Alright, that's fine. Um, boom. Alright. There's a big old ship right there. Okay. And vehicles. Okay, they, oh, see, I can make... No, not that I can't make the Cyclops just yet. In the future. A prawn suit! Now, that is some some stuff. Plastilin gets is really expensive. Aerogel isn't... I, I think I can do that, actually, right now, if I wanted to. In the glass would be kind of just difficult, and I think I have the diamonds and lead for it, so it won't be too hard to collect. The main thing you need to get is stalker teeth, which is used to make the plasteel ingots and the emerald glass it's just stronger. I don't know what that what's in these their, their teeth, snaggle teeth, to, to make this stuff so strong, but it's going to be very useful. Anyway, um, that'll be in the future, possibly next episode, either that or exploring the giant alien structure. I really don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seek fluid intake. Yeah. But I took so much fluid intake. Just ah, earlier this episode. Okay. Num. Num. I'll, I'll get more food and stuff later. I need to find the fragments for a filtration, water filtration machine. That's so useful. I need, I need to just make, do some exploring at some point. Anyway, thank you people for watching. Um, got, got, got good progress. Got good progress. I have a better power source, which isn't as reliable as I hoped it would be, but I, I can throw in stuff whenever I want to. Um, yeah, I got stuff done. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the future.